Hey guys, I just wanted to show you a quick walkthrough of the house. Uh, as soon as you walk in, you have the beautiful vintage sofa with a bunch of plates on it. And the plates are actually kind of cool. They're a little bit different than what I'm used to seeing when it comes to Norman Rockwell, if that makes any sense to anybody. But anyway, those are just some of the plates. Um, and then we have this table here that has storage underneath. And if left to the door, you've got the coin collection, and then the costume jewelry, and then the register, of course. If you walk in and go to the right, you have the hallway. Go to the right again, and you have the room with the quilt rack and the MCM furniture, which is so cool because it's such a big set, and it's the whole set. And of course, you know, we've got the sewing and the craft stuff in here as well. Headboard, frame. And then in the closet, we've got some linens. And this here is actually uh, a set. So you have the pillows with the comforter down below. And again, above the doors, we've got more plates, more plates, more plates. So make sure you look up above every doorway of every kind because they're there. Then the hall closet has toiletries and coats. Across from that is the office area where you have clothing, plates up top, um, <clears throat> purses. And these purses are actually really neat. I noticed this the other day and I was kind of impressed. Check that out. That a zipper right in the middle. So you put all your stuff in your bag, close up your bag, and you're good to go. Looks like a purse. It's pretty cool. Anyway, there's a handful of those different styles in there. Books, some games, office stuff, cords, wires, same as always. The desk is built in, so the desk will not be for sale. And neither will these built-in shelves. But then you get to the movies. And what a collection of movies they had. And it is a huge collection. And it's a very good collection. There's a lot of really, really good movies. Even though they're not movies I would watch, they're still good movies. Um, but anyway, we come back out of this room. Hall closet. At the end of the hall, you have this bedroom. And the lighting will be better. I just don't have the windows open. But there's more ladies' clothes and shoes. It's a nice vintage piece. It's a really beautiful bed. It's a single, it's a twin and matching dresser and lingerie chest, of course, and a wooden hamper. And then in the bathroom, hi, that's me. Hello, there I am, hello. Um, anyway, <laughs> I'm tired, I haven't slept much. Um, <laughs> And then in the, hey, look, 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 more plates. They're so cool too. They're just, they're different and I love them. I'm sure you've seen some of these in the pictures, but anyway. So yeah, as soon as you walk in through the front door, if you go straight, you go into the kitchen. This is where we are and that's where the washing machine is. The dryer is outside. And yes, that's how it was set up. But this is where the... Exxon plates are. We've got chickens and stuff everywhere. Um, you know, up in the cabinets above the doorway is that. That's a complete glass dinner set there. Corningware, kitchen stuff, all that wonderful stuff. This is the, the Lennox Christmas dish set. It's actually a 12 place, 12 place setting. And I believe it's seven pieces each place setting. It's really pretty. And there's the secretary, which can also be used in the kitchen, of course. However you want. And then we've got, oh, it's above my head, sorry. All that. And all that. And then we've got the pantry stuff inside and then in this 
is where the garage used to be. Um, but we've got some really great um, old photos. They are wrapped up, but basically because they have information on the back of them with a sticker, and I didn't want to lose that sticker and thought that was important to keep. But here's the rest of the MCM furniture. Got a few records, some Norman Rockwell plates, the vintage cabinets, the Pioneer stereo, the Bose stereo or radio. Um, client said either he doesn't know how or it just doesn't turn on. My guess is he probably just didn't know how because I couldn't figure it out either. <laughs> Um, anyway, there's more plates in the cabinet. And these albums are full of pictures from trips and stuff. We've got some great glassware, <clears throat> some Faustoria. This right here is a whole set, and we even have water glasses that match it in the kitchen. In here are all the birds. Hello again. And over there are more plates and stuff. We've got the humble mirror down there. And then this is the table with the Franciscan apple. And we have this complete set here. All of this, plus the glasses, I believe is 103 pieces. And it's a place setting for eight plus. So there's like, there's a, a full complete eight place setting. And then you have, you know, extra pieces of other stuff. And then we go outside you have this bench long wooden bench and a refrigerator does work it's just a little vintagey but it does work um, over here to the right of the back door are the rest of the plates I wasn't lying there is a ton of them these are all holiday plates down here they're still in the boxes um, she did a really really good job of putting the year and the title of the plate so if you're looking for a specific year or a specific um, plate in and of itself it'll be really easy to find um, these are still obviously boxed up those are still boxed up these are all still boxed up this is where those really unusual plates are which i love those those are cool um, if I were to collect plates, those would be the plates I collect. And then, of course, we've got some Christmas and stuff underneath. Oops, sorry. I said sorry to the plates. Oh, my God. Anyway, there's the trunks. Another filing cabinet. It's a really nice glass display. We've got some convalescent items, outdoor pieces. On the little gazebo area, we've got all our storage tubs lined up and ready to go home with somebody. You got a really cute bird bath with a squirrel that's cute and a sundial I didn't see that one ladder and then there's nothing in the shed so don't worry about that but uh, yeah that's pretty much it oh no it's not I lied as soon as you walk outside there's this little room here and it's a little dark in here my apologies but you have these two metal cabinets which are great and you've got stuff inside just some random stuff books and whatnot we've got you know stuff back here and more christmas there's a snoopy christmas holiday stuff chemicals you know just a little bit of leftover stuff that we didn't really have a place for inside and then the dryer is also in here so that now pretty much covers it <laughs> that is the tour um anyway we hope that we see you we can't wait to see you um there is so much stuff here so much great stuff i think you guys will really enjoy it and uh we will see you thursday thanks guys bye